Kathleen Alice Matea was born June 21, 1959, and is better known as Cassie Matea. She is an American country music and bluegrass singer, active since 1984 as a recording artist. She has charted more than 30 singles on the Billboard's Hot Country Songs charts, including four that reached number one, Going Gone, 18 Wheels and a Dozen Roses, Come From the Heart, and Burning Old Memories, plus 12 more that charted within the top 10. She has released 14 studio albums, two Christmas albums, and one Greatest Hits album. Most of her material was recorded for Universal Music Group Nashville's Mercury Records Nashville Division between 1984 and 2000, with later albums being issued on Narada Productions, her own Captain Potato label, and Sugar Hill Records. Among her albums, she has received five gold certifications and one platinum certification from the Recording Industries Association of America. She has collaborated with Dolly Parton, Michael McDonald, Tim O'Brien, and her husband, John Vesner. Matea is also a two-time Grammy Award winner. In 1990 for Where You've Been and 1993 for her Christmas album, Good News. Her style is defined by traditional country, bluegrass, folk, and Celtic music influences. Matea has been married to songwriter John Vesner since February 14, 1988. He started a publishing company underneath the apartment in which Matea lived in the 1980s, and the two met after he jump-started her car. Vesner wrote four of Matea's singles, Where Have You Been, Whole Lot of Holes, Time Passes By, and A Few Good Things Remain along with singles by Diamond Rio and Clay Walker. Matea is known for her roles in AIDS activism. In 1992, many televised award shows were handing out red ribbons to participants in honor of AIDS awareness, but the Country Music Association chose to hand out green ribbons promoting environmental awareness instead. Matea chose to wear three red ribbons that night, each one honoring a friend of hers who had died of the disease, along with the green ribbon. A 1994 article in the Chicago Tribune noted that a Nashville newspaper interpreted a comment she had made on wearing both color ribbons as a confrontation and that Matea was often questioned as to whether her activism had a negative impact on sales of her then-current albums. Besides her participation in the Red, Hot, and Country charity album series, Matea also participated in charity concerts and made public appearances at activism campaigns. She was also the recipient of the inaugural Harvard AIDS Initiative Award in 1994. We just wanted to give her a shout out and thank her for all her good works. Okay, that's the end of our video. I sure hope you enjoyed it. If you like this type of video and want us to keep producing them, please like and subscribe. And as always, thank you very much for watching.